Hello guys, it's me, Bad Jokes, back at you once again with another video. And today, guys, we've got episode number four of my Met Please Save here on FM19. And we've got a massive game today. We are at home against Fatchum in the big freebet.com cup. And why is it a big game? Well, I might be getting sacked already. Alright guys, let's have a look at the results since you was last with me and it's not hard to see why I am in the position of I might be getting sacked. There's not a lot of green there is there people? Not a lot at all. Uh, so since you was here, we won against Froome Town, we won against Basingstoke Town 2-1 and 3-1 respectively. And there yeah, Charlie Collins with a couple in that game. Jack Mazzone with a goal as well. More news on him very shortly. And then after that one, we went almost a whole month of September without a win. We drew with Hartley Whitney, lost to Hendon, drew with Gosport, lost in the FA Cup second qualifying round to Marsham, and then we lost again to Paul Town. But then finally we got a result, a 2-1 win against Salisbury. Harry Stanley and Robinson with the goals. And then we got another win against Stratford Town. Bailey Mummery with the winner for us there after just 12 minutes. But now we have gone five games without a win. We lost to Tiverton Town 4-2. We lost, we drew even, with Swindon Supermarine 0-0. Drew with Chesham, 1-1. One, one. And then Weymouth, Jack Mazone scoring the winner for Weymouth. Yep, that's right, Jack Mazone. He has left the football club on a free transfer. Not much I could do, really. I understand he is one of Met Police's best players in real life. But if you have a look at how he was getting on for me, eight games, one goal, one assist, a 6.6. .6. And then Weymouth came in for him. And his one goal, ironically, has been against us. So isn't that just typical FM? So yeah, that was a thrilling game. 4-3, look at that. They went 1-0 up and then we got it back to 1-1. They then made it 2-1, 3-1. And then it was 3-2. And then 4-2 and then 4-3. So I thought maybe we might have got back into it. But it wasn't to be. And then our latest game, a 3-1 defeat against Beaconsfield, takes us to where we are today. And if we have a look at the league table, we are 19th with just those three wins. But not a league game today. We've got the game against Fatum for you guys. And if you have a look at the board confidence, precarious. Oh no. Yeah, so... We need to start improving and improving quickly. And so that is what we are going to do. First up, I'm going to show you through the transfers that I have brought in since you was last here. Or I'll show you all of them because I don't think I've shown you the transfers yet. Harry Stanley, you've seen a bit of. He's on loan from Swindon. Ryan Edmonds, you've also seen a little bit of. He's been really disappointing. He came in. From Sutton Coalfield. And yeah, look at that. Nine appearances. Only the two assists. A 6.5. But I just have not been able to find any other left wingers. So that's how he's keeping his place in the team. And then there's Shura Fell. Who's a right winger. Who again come in on a free. He's had a year or so out of the game. Five appearances. Three assists. Only an average rating of 6.4 though. Things are not going well for these. And then Jerry Amu. Another right winger. He's come in off from Chelmsford. Only the one appearance so far, but that was a 6.7. And he started off at, at West Ham. So that's very nice to see us Irons sticking together. And next in after him is another striker. Brian Barton. He's a poacher. He's supposed to be decent. He looks okay there. Nothing special, but... We're not scoring goals, so I'm just trying to throw anything at it. He's only played the one game, and that was a sub-appearance at that. So I don't really want to talk too much about that. 
And then the latest guy to come in permanently is Trey Williams, again a striker. He looks so-so, doesn't he? But you never know. Hopefully he can improve a bit. Again, just a one appearance for him. And that was a 6.4. And out of the club, George Smethurst is gone. Jack Mazzone, you know about. Ross Murdoch, or Murdo, he's gone. And Josh Webb. Yet three of them have gone on loan, all of them apart from Mazzone. And so let's go look at the team for today's game. We've got Luke Williams in goal. We've got Billy Brown on the left. Myers on the right. Robinson and Arthur in the centre of defence. Robertson and Stanley in the middle of the park. Edmonds and Amu up uh, on the wings. And then Blackmore and Collins up top. And so let's go and hope, 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 hope. I really do hope we can get a result. I need a win. And come on, lads. We need a win. I'm so nervous. I've put off doing this video for about four or five days. I've been so nervous about this and possibly getting the old tin tack. Uh, Factum, let's shout them out as I have been doing on the other videos. We've got Holmes in goal and Gaff on the left of the defence. Salata on the right and that is Ludlam in the centre of defence and Nicole Wilson alongside him. And then we've got Powell, Jenkinson, Smith in the middle of the park and then Campbell and Geecock on the wings alongside Chris Walden who's up front all alone. So let's go into the team. I'm going to go assertively or do I go passionate? This is, a great opportunity. this is a great opportunity to show the critics they're wrong. And a couple of them are motivated. I think there's a lot more to come from you. And it's, it's working a bit. It's working better than it has been, people. So let's go kick the game off. And now first highlight of the game. Fatsum with it. They're coming forward with the ball. But we win it back. Robinson clears it long. Goes to Blackmore. Can he find a teammate? He does. Goes to Edmonds who kicks it long. And it's Collins heading it down. He crosses it into the box. It's Amu. Amu, sorry, he crosses it. And yes! Max Blackmore with the perfect start to the game. Two minutes in. That was very, very nice to see. I was certain Amu here was going to shoot. But he squared it and Blackmore puts the ball into the empty net. Come on, you please. Just about 16 minutes gone now. And we've got the ball again. It's a move to Collins. To Robertson. To Stanley. Blackmore's in. Blackmore scores. 2-0. Yes. 15 minutes gone now. Max Blackmore with his third of the season. And yes, this is a better performance. I know Factum are probably a couple leagues below us. But this is nice to see... For me, I've I've not seen us score this many goals. So this is very nice to see for me, who has been who has been playing the game for the last week or so. Alright guys, that's half time. Max Blackmore's double has given us complete control of this game. We've had four shots, three on target, to their three on to their three shots with zero on target. Possession has been 50-50. But we have definitely been the more clinical. And so I'm going to go team talk. I'm going to go passionate. I'm very pleased. Keep it going, lads. And everybody's happy. You know what? Who's that who's a little bit knackered? 77%. Jerry Amu. Yeah, I'm going to take you off. Give you a rest. I think this game is pretty much won. So let's go start the second half. With that being the only change. Gottman coming on for Amu. Alright guys, today's match day sponsor is TDG, aka The Don Gaming. As you can see, I've got all his logos on me kits. They look very, very snazzy on there. I think you will all agree. He's a very awesome guy, very awesome content creator. And he's currently got a Rangers save going on at the minute. So, go and check him out. His links are going to be down below. Go and subscribe to him. And if you do, tell him I sent you. That'll help me out massively. So thank you guys. Go and check him out. And now to the second half. Here we are. First highlight of the second half. It's Slatter with a free kick. Williams has spilt it. And he's very, very lucky. That's only gone out for a corner. 
it's going to be Slatter to take it. And we get it away, but we are under a lot of pressure. Campbell with the ball, crosses it in, and it goes out for a goal kick. I thought that might have been a corner. And now an hour gone. Thatcham are back in it. Free kick there. Gone to David Nicole Wilson at the far post. And Slatter there. And yeah, that was far, far too easy for Wilson to get his team back into the game. Was it offside? No. Mm, close. That was tight. And now it's Thatcham coming back at us again. They're in and Williams with a great stop there. I think I'm going to have to be bringing my t my wingers back to the midfield role, I think. We are getting overrun a little bit. Blackmore heads it away. Goes to Jenkinson. Can we win this back, please? Ludlam, Nicole Wilson. And that's the end of that. And I am going to move my wingers back to in into a more traditional 4-4-2 shape. And I'm going to bring Williams on for Robertson just to try and avoid... Anyone getting sent off. Now, again, it's Fatsum coming at us. Smith with it. Back to Powell. To Smith. Oh, come on, Slatter, come on. We need to close him down. Get the ball back. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh. Come on. Concentrate, people. Concentrate. Gendo, if you're watching, here's one for you. Concentrate, concentrate. And now Robinson to Collins. And can Collins, can he get this into the box? He crosses it and Slatter heads it away. But we've got five minutes left. Come on, come on, can we see this game out? I'm going to go balanced just to try and hold on to things. And that's Williams with the ball. And Gaff clears it. And we win it back, Stanley, to Gockman. To Myers. Collins is in. Collins squares it. Blackmore with a hat trick. Yes. Max Blackmore is taking the match ball home. Very, very good performance from him. And now let's have a look at this on the replay. Myers with a great little ball there. Collins with a touch. Blackmore powering it past the keeper. That should be the game won, surely. There you are, lads. That is a better result. Max Blackmore with a hat-trick. David Nicole Wilson with their consolation. And let's go into the team talk. I'm going to go passionately. I'm very pleased with the result and your performance. And you know what? I'm going to make this a little bit of a longer episode. And we're going to play the Merthyr Town game as well. Because it is the league that is more important. So I'll be back with you guys in a minute for the Merthyr game. Alright guys, here we are, ready for the game against Merthyr. Merthyr are the favourites, even though they are only two league positions above us. So this is a winnable game, and if we do win it, we go above them and get to somewhere near lower mid-table, which would be a very nice start to start improving things. And let's go on to the team for today's game. Only the two changes. Tom Nayama comes in in the central midfield attacking role. And Sam Williams comes in in the central defensive role. Because both the players who do play in those positions are suspended. So that's why they're coming in. Then let's go crack on with this. And get what would be a massive three points. To try and help me keep me job. Which would be very, very nice. And okay. Murtha are going with a 3-5-2 formation. Interesting. So they've got Wharton in goal, Threlfall in Threlfall, Cyrus and Parsons in their central defence, Hunt and Little as the wing backs, Patton, Lucas, Joyce in the middle of the midfield, really. Bowen and Meachin up top. Can we do something against this team? I would love us to get a league win. It's been a while. So let's go. Uh, this is a great opportunity to say the quicks, they're wrong. Yep, that's got a few of them motivated. There's a lot more to come from you. There's a lot more to come from you. Now nobody's taking any notice. Okay. Well, let's go win this game. Come on, lads.
First highlight of the game is their keeper kicking it long, but we win it back. Edmonds with a long ball there to precisely nobody. And now Murphy coming forward with the ball, and we pick it up again. Myers back to Williams. Williams goes long. Can a moon knock this down? No, he can't. And goes to Patton. And oh, that's a big tackle there, but we've won it back. And Blackmore's through. Blackmore, he's got some space. He crosses it. Yes, Ryan Edmonds with, with his first goal for the club. Every press conference since he's joined, I've had Edmonds has been disappointed. Disappointing. Edmonds has been disappointing. Not anymore, he's not. He scored a huge goal for us. Come on. What a start this is. Now, 22 minutes gone. Murphy are coming forward with the ball. Little with it. But we collect it nicely there. Myers tries to go long, but Hunt heads it. Goes to Patton. To Hunt. And come on. Oh, yes. Robertson with the interception. He goes long. Blackmore's through. Blackmore is through. Blackmore scores. Come on. Come on. 2-0 to the police. 2-0 to the men in blue. 2-0 to the men in blue. Yes. Oh, very, very nice finish there from Blackmore. And all of a sudden, things are looking a lot better for us. Now, just over half an hour gone. Murphy coming forward with the ball. Little to Joyce, to Lucas, to Patton. And we get it away again. But they nod it forward on the halfway line. Patton with the ball to Bowen and a bit of a collision there and everybody goes down. But now it's little, oh, that's awful keeping. Oh, what was the keeper thinking there? What on earth was that about? He just lost his head. What? I have no idea where the keeper is going here. Look, he's already running. Past the man there. He's got no intention of going towards Meachin. And then he's tried to pick it up there. What on earth is he doing? I am an awful keeper, but even I would do better than that. I'm going to go concentrate. And everybody's overwhelmed. Of course they are. And now it's Amu with a free kick. Nayama with a header. And just over. And now Brown with a throw in. The ball goes into the box. Parsons has it now on the left hand side. Can we win it back? No we can't. It goes to Patton. Oh come on. Can we see this through to half time please? Meacham with it. Meacham with it. It's off the bar. Oh, oh, oh my days, oh no. Come on, half time cannot come soon enough. Well, that's half time, people. We've had five shots. Both of our shots on target have gone into the back of the net. Murtha have had nine shots with two hitting the target, one hitting the back of the net. And I'm going to get into the lads and I'm going to say to them, concentrate. Don't get complacent. I'm going to go assertive, yeah. Don't think the job is done. A couple of them are stressed. Well, you need to start being a little less unstressed. And that one is. And now, come on. Come on, Collins. Don't be stressed. Okay, and be stressed then. Whatever you want. Let's go start the second half. And hopefully, we can see this through. All right, guys. 65 minutes gone. Just the one change being made right now. Trey Williams coming on for Charlie Collins. We've had no highlights as of yet in this second half. And now 20 minutes left. Amu is unable to win the ball. But our ball goes into the box. And Ryan Edmonds. Disappointing much. Journos, you know nothing. You know nothing. I knew he was going to come good. I've defended him every week since we signed him. And Edmonds now, with a double, is repaying that faith. And this could be two wins in the episode. Get in. Five minutes left to go. Murphy, oh, Murphy made it nervous again. Murphy with the corner. 
and Cyrus just rifling it home. Let's have a look at this on the replay. Little with it. Cyrus, yeah, just powering it home. And so immediately, I'm going to be dragging the midfielders down. And we're going to go a bit more balanced and just see this game through. Please, please, please. Brown with a throw in. Lucas heads it away. And Ezra Whaley coming forward. They've lumped it long. Oh, no, 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 no. Taylor boy, no. Oh, I really thought we was going to win a game. You know what, sod it. Let's go back to what we was doing. And we're going to go attacking. I want to win this game of football. I'm going to make another change. Gokman on for a move for the last few minutes. And then go confirm changes. Oh, I haven't gone attacking, have I? Whoops. Uh, now Luke Williams kicking the ball long. Is one of our men going to get onto it? Nope. Uh, it's Murphy doing all the running. Myers clears it. Oh no. Ezraeli with a long shot. That was ambitious. Oh now come on. Five minutes left. I'm going to go very attacking. Blackmore with it. We're in injury time. And Threlfall nods it back to his keeper. And is he going to just hold on to it for the last five minutes? Nope, he kicks it long. Arthur heads it on. It's Gockman with it. Edmunds, can he get himself a hat-trick? That would be beautiful. Blackmore! Blackmore, yes! Come on! 4-3. Max Blackmore with now his sixth of the season. His fourth, I believe, of the episode. And yes, Gockman with a beautiful pass there. Edmunds with his best performance to date. And yes, 4-3 with only a few minutes left. Let's go back to balanced. And let's see this one out. Yes, there's the full-time whistle. Oh, that was stressful. Oh, but we've got our first win for a while. Only our fourth in the league. And get in, lads. Let's go team talk. Let's go congratulate the lads. People, That was really special, that's what I'm going to say. Yep, everybody's delighted, as they should be. And maybe, just maybe, that might be the springboard to the rest of our season. And well, that's where I'm going to leave it for today, lads. We're now in 16th in the table. We're moving on up. And so, that's where I'm going to leave it. If you've enjoyed the video, give me a massive thumbs up down below subscribe to the channel for more content like this I've, i need 31 more for 400 by the end of the year if we could do that that would be amazing and uh, follow me on twitter at bad jokes gaming and just one thing left to say i am bad jokes gaming i'm out <laughs>